بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ٹوڈے آور ٹاپک از انوائرمنٹل ایجوکیشن اٹ سبجیکٹ از کنٹیمپریری ایشوز اینڈ ٹرینڈز ان ایجوکیشن اٹ از لیکچر نمبر ایٹین اینڈ اٹس کوڈ از تھری ایٹ ون ٹوڈے آور آبجیکٹوز آر ٹو اسٹڈی اباؤٹ ڈیفینیشن میننگ میٹ امپورٹنس اینڈ اسکوپ رول آف ٹیچرس ان میٹنگ دا چیلنجز آف ایئر واٹر لینڈ اینڈ نوائز پولوشن effects on human animals and plants and roles of individuals public and government the recent trends in environmental education first of all what is meant by environmental education environmental education is the process that allows individuals to explore environmental issues engage in problem solving and take actions to improve the environment as a result individuals develop a deeper understanding of environmental issues and have the skills to make informed and responsible decisions man as a part and parcel of the environment has to recognize the role and importance of environment in order to protect it and to get protections from it for this he needs environmental education if we define the environmental education so it is a process to promote awareness and understanding of the environment its relationship with the man and its activities it is also aimed at developing responsible actions necessary for preservations conservations and improvement of the environment and its component according to international union for the conservation of nature it is being defined that the process of recognizing values and clarifying concepts in order to develop skills and attitudes necessary to understand and appreciate the interrelatedness among man his culture and his biophysical surroundings environmental education also entails practice in decision making and self formation of the code of behavior about issues concerning environmental quality what's its meaning environmental education refers to the organized efforts to teach how nature environment in functions and particularly how human beings can manage behavior and ecosystems to live sustainability it is a multidisciplinary field interchanging or integ- integrating disciplines such as bio- biology chemistry physics ecology uh, and uh, art sciences atmospheric science mathematics and geography environmental education which is relatively new is an interdisciplinary process that aims at uh, equipping people with the knowledge attitudes skills and motivations that they need to help resolve environmental issues then need for the environmental education we all know that uh, uh, educational environmental education is very necessary because it teaches us about the ourselves and uh, reminds us that nature and people are not separate so we are nature and nature is us environmental education is necessary because we should all be informed and aware of the impacts of our decisions some form of environmental pollutions affect each and every nation through the issues differ some of the most urgent environmental threats to be dealt with now and in the future and environmental institutions all over the world have been making intense efforts to meet the challenges arising from politics science and public opinion toward integrating environmental concerns then what is the importance of environmental education we all know that environmental education helps students understand how their decisions and actions affect the environment builds knowledge and skills necessary to address complex environmental issues as well as the ways we can take actions to keep our environment healthy and sustainable for the future essentials for the self fulfillment and social development of the child and the adults essentials for understanding the different food chains and nature of ecological balance it plays an important role in understanding and appreciating how the environment is used for making our living and promoting material culture 
it enables one to uh, appreciate and enjoy nature and society it inculcates a concern for the systematic change of environment for the distance and immediate welfare of mankind it makes uh, one dis- conscious of the problems of uh, population explosion depletion of natural resources global warming then scope of environmental education the scope of environmental education is also called the content or subject matter of environmental education so there are different aspects of the environment among them the biological physical social and cultural aspects are important then there are uh, there is some role of teacher in meeting the challenges of uh, air pollution teachers are the most pivotal part in the classrooms they are the one who can provide link in delivering environmental knowledge and create among the students the awareness of problems associated with environment teacher can play an important role in making the program of environmental education successful it's a worldwide campaign about smoking like use of good quality of automobile fuels planting trees afforestation uh, air pollution checking by cyclone collectors electrostatic and precipitators motor vehicles sulfur free and uh, lead free fuel non combustible sources of energy factories chimneys that should be tall and using air filters and awareness programs should be there to meet the challenges of air pollution then what is the role of uh, uh, teacher in challenging of water pollution like waste water it should be treated before it discharge into lake or river and proper filtration or filtering mechanism should be there use of uh, herbicide and pesticides it should be minimized pollutants removed by suitable methods like absorptions elect uh, electrodialysis ion exchange uh, reverse osmosis industrial effluents and thermal pollutants should be reutilized urban waste like uh, to be reused to generate cheaper fuel gas and electricity biological and physical methods like uh, restore species to diversity and to maintain ecological balance in the water bodies then role of teacher in meeting the challenges of land pollution you can prevent land pollution by minimizing the eliminating waste at the source and substituting non toxic options for hazardous material reforestation uh, ergonomic methods like counter planting counter forrowing counter cropping Uh, mulching and leaf forming constructions of dams control gazing soil fertility forest management use of bio fertilizers and natural man- man- manures uh, wind breaks and wind shields and uh, then special pits like dumping industrial waste and afforestations like barren areas should be uh, treated as uh, afforestations uh recycling and recovery of materials like agricultural waste and then uh, paper plastic and uh, glosses and public awareness programs should be there so if we reduce chemical fertilizer and pesticides then we can meet the challenge of land pollution uh we should uh, reforestation pay attention on that and solid waste treatment it is a very important uh, issue to address so recovering and recycling material so this is to meet the challenges of land pollution and proper control teacher in meeting the challenges of noise pollution so there are also different ways like control lies from the get go a lot of times get go into into the classroom already wired from the fun they were having with their friends in between periods or break time so single uh s- signal your students to get quiet take away privileges offer uh, incentives and find the source like gadgets it should be developed unmuffs industrial workers or traffic control personnel nice sections of the factory located far away and uh, room walls sound absorbers 
loud speakers it should be avoided uh, we should avoid use of loud speakers and uh, we should not teacher are expected to discharge uh, the following functions what are the functions how to reduce noise pollution developing awareness about environmental issues turn off appliances at home and offices shut the door when using noisy machines providing specific and scientific knowledge topic wise organizing community service on issues relating to conservation and protection of environment use ear plugs lower the volumes organizing social services and community service programs stay away from the noisy areas follow the limits of noise levels organizing population days and environmental days organizing awareness campaigns control noise level near sensitive areas go green by planting trees organizing visits to uh, pollution control centers and uh, organizing exhibitions on environmental pollution and control organizing trees plantations or uh, vema host saves organizing lectures and workshops for the benefits of the community developing habits of uh, cleanliness among students ensuring cleanliness of the school plots arranging lectures of experts on environmental issues impressing upon students to adopt the following ways of protecting and improving the environment what are those ways like dispose the waste after separating them into bio degradable and non biodegradable stored a composite heap and uh, or use a composite bin don't burn any waste means plastic reuse carrier bags avoid fast starts and sudden braking of automobiles walk or cycle use public transport use unleaded petrol plant trees print as little as necessary re use of recycle use a reusable beverage containers don't throw your notes away save electricity save water avoid taking cars or carpool with possible observes world environmental day on 5th june air water land and noise pollution and effect on human animals and plants floods irrigations drought soil erosions sediments load of the river siltations intensification of greenhouse effects etc nitrates like respiratory uh, respiratory disorders mind dust effects all chemical fertilizers increasing the salt content of the salt radioactive uh, minerals great damage to human improper irrigation practices in habit plant so there are some direct or international impacts like application of chemicals fertilizer pesticides and insecticides like high yields and economic development and if change in soil chemistry so it soil degradations indirect or unintentional impacts what are those experienced after long time when they become cumulative not uh, reversible related to pollution and environmental degradation use of chemicals such as ddt bhc excessive use of pesticides fertilizers and uh, number of other chemicals for example toxic materials are transported across the placenta and reach the developing fetuses of women and causes abs abs abortions and delivery of the premature child photochemical smoke 
eye irritations, respiratory problems and cancer, acid rain, uh, depletes the nutrients in soil and destroy plants, chlorosis and necrosis in plants, irritations in the eyes and skin of human beings, affects aquatic life, airborne fluoride and arsenic pollutions, injuries to agricultural livestock, greenhouse effects, definitely it has a skin cancer, ozone layer depletions, it also affects cancer, and uh, it, uh, air pollutions affect weather and climate at global level. Industrial growth and environmental impacts. The industrial revolutions impacted the environment. The world saw the major increase in pollutions, which along with increase in living standards led to the depletion of natural resources. The use of chemicals and fuels in factories resulted in increased air and water pollutions and an increased use of fossil fuels. Industrial expansions, which is the release of uh, enormous quantities of pollutants, ions of chlorine, sodium sulfate, magnesium phosphate, and coal consumptions in thermal plants like uh, flash smoke, sulfur oxide, and other. Burning of hydrocarbon fuels increase concentrations of CO2 in the atmosphere, means carbon dioxide, increase in global atmosphere. When it uh, be, uh, mix with the water H2O then it becomes H2CO3 carbonic acid change the soil chemistry global warming ongoing effect includes rising seas levels due to the thermal expansion and melting the glaciers and ice sheets and warming of the ocean surface uh, leading to increased temperature stratification. So other possible effects include large scale changes in ocean circulations. In global warming we can see that how the ozone layers protect the direct rays from the sun. Now see here the oxygen plus hemoglobin that uh, goes to the oxy uh, hemoglobins then supply of oxygens throughout our body then it becomes normal reactions and carbon monoxide when it makes with the hemoglobin so it prevents of the oxyhemoglobins then it becomes supply of the carbon monoxide and then abnormal reactions comes in and the result of it now see this is a cycle that uh, uh, nitrates in food in water goes to the nitrates by bacteria in digestive system and then it causes uh, nit um, nitrates antibody muscular system it combines with the hemoglobins and then trigger a lot of metabolic disorders industrial waste like chemicals metals soil wastes and garbages release of CFS means chlorofluorocarbons Depletion of ozone surface, the sulfur dioxide reacts quickly with atmospheric moisture, sulfur acid, respiratory diseases, and acid rains. So, this is how that from uh, this is a cycle from uh, soils to animals and plants and then from food to animals or food to human beings and then uh, also from uh, animals to human being. So this is a cycle um, that how uh, it affects directly or indirectly to the human being. Depletion of ozone layers or ozone hole. Set of a height of uh, 72 km contains care amount of water vapors, thin layer ozone uh, gas less than 1 ppm absorbs ultraviolet rays, protective rays, uh, ultraviolet rays influence the body in many ways and it is beneficial effects that formation of vitamin D in the sun. Now see that from the earth, uh, tropophere this is 0 to 10 kilometers after that there is ozone layer and uh, 
stratosphere this is around 10 to 50 kilometers decrease in 1% of ozone 3% increase in non melanoma skin cancer men increase in incidence of diseases like uh, measles chickenpox uh, chickenpox and other uh, viral diseases affecting the skin by inducing rash bacterial infections like tuberculosis and uh, leprosy and fungal infections uh, us environment protection agency 0.3 to 0.6 percent increase plant affected during photosynthesis in 1985 atmospheric scientists of british and talking service came into uh, with a stalling report indicating that was the depletion of ozone in the atmosphere over the Halley Bay in Antarctica. Between 1977 and uh, 1984, more than 40 percent of the ozone layer had decreased. Uh, wider than the cont continent uh, the, uh, and extended about 12 to 24 kilometers in altitude. The concentration of uh, ozone is decreasing at the rate of 0.3 percent every year. All life on earth come to an end within 60 days and similar holes thickly populated northern hemisphere. In 1988 developing countries agreed to eliminate 90 percent of ozone depleting substances by 2000. And polluted water like cholera, typhoid, jodice, amvices, polio, and uh, condemn polluted water uh, tie -tie, and uh, excess of uh, nitrate and drinking water and discharge of hot water from industries uh, arsonous contaminated water organic compounds mercury compounds in waste matter waste water impairment of hearing eardrum damage anxiety and stress inversible change in nervous system heat uh, heart beat and peric ulcers and asthma psychological disorders like hdbltv aso as asomnia fear and many such problems about the role of individuals in the environmental protections like curb or greet animal part like skin fur ivory bones nails etc adopt vegetarian plant trees avoid uh, using insecticides, pesticides and inorganic fertilizers, paper and cloth should replace Use the efficient of uh, one industry as the raw material of another, example ash uh, to make uh, maximum, uh, minimize our needs, recycle paper, glass or plastic, 70% of glass recycled to Holland and Germany, make children aware of their surroundings and need for biodiversity, follow traditional agriculture practices, Make use of sustainable technologies, smokeless, chawless ground uh, water, recharging unit and uh, wind energy, solar. Saving energy. How can we save energy? Turn off necessary lights, use light bulbs of premium voltage, eliminate unnecessary outdoor and decorative lighting, replace your presence light bulbs with electronic fluorescent lamps 10 times longer than 75% less, less electricity. Substituting a compact fluorescent bulb for a traditional bulb keep half a ton of carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere. Uh, one large uh, ordinary bulb is more efficient than two small ones in a multi bulb fixtures. Cut down on the use of electric appliances. At summers, shut windows, blind curtains, and doors early in the morning to keep the house cool. Lower the thermostat. Install a solar water heating system. Turn off stove immediately after use. Use pressure cooker. Plan well and keep the ingredients ready before you start. Saving paper is saving trees. Use paper carefully. Write on both sides of the sheet. Save envelopes, sewed letters and junk mail. Not use paper towels and tissues in household cleaning activities. Use old towels, sheet and clothes. Don't use paper plates and tissues or papers. Uh, decorations when you have a reducing the use of automobile fuels like sharing the uh, vehicles and use public role of public in the environmental protection what is the role of uh, public 
ensure sustainable and uh, equitable use of resources without de degrading the environment or risking healthy or safety prevent and control degradation of land water vegetation and air conserve and enhance natural and man made heritage including biological diversity of unique ecosystems there are some recent trends in environmental uh, education like preschool level moral stories and rhythms concerning the worth of nature and environment uh, proper knowledge about the things around us personal hygiene and environmental cleanliness awareness through col colorful pictures and posters and uh, diag diagrammatic representations made to uh, show love and compassion and compassion for all the living Allah Hafiz